it did not specify when or if it would ease a blockade on commercial traffic. Hodeida, which is controlled by Houthi rebels backed by Saudi Arabia's art rival Iran, is a key conduit for much-needed food and medicine imports to Yemen. The coalition imposed a total blockade of Yemen's ports and airports two days after the Houthis fired a missile at Saudi Arabia on November 4. The missile was intercepted near Riyadh's King Khalid International Airport, sparking a war of words between Tehran and Riyadh, which accused Iran of direct aggression and supplying arms to the Houthis. The United Nations said Wednesday it had been notified by the Saudi authorities of the reopening on Thursday of the Yemeni ports of Hodeidah and Salayouf, as well as Sana'a Airport. We are monitoring these developments and we are trying to see whether that actually takes place on the ground, UN spokesman Farhan Haq told reporters at UN headquarters in New York. Aid group Save the Children welcomed the coalition's announcement but said opening the port and airport would be nowhere near enough to avert a potential famine in Yemen. Humanitarian relief only provides a small portion of the essential goods needed in Yemen, commercial supplies are critical to feed the population and keep basic services running, it said. UN aid chief Mark Lokok called on November 8 for the blockade to be lifted warning that Yemen would otherwise face the largest famine the world has seen for decades. The Houthi government on Tuesday announced the country's main international airport was fully functional again a week after a Saudi-led airstrike destroyed the facility's navigation system. The airport had been open to only select humanitarian flights. In 2015, Saudi Arabia and its allies joined the Yemeni government's fight against the rebels. More than 8,750 people have since been killed. The country also faces a deadly cholera epidemic and millions stand at the brink of official famine. The UN Food and Agriculture Organization, FAO, says Yemen is highly dependent on imported wheat for its basic needs.